You wake up, look in the mirror, and there it is, a pimple. But what's really going on beneath your skin? To find out, we need to go deep, under the surface. Beneath every tiny hair on your body, there's a small oil factory called a sebaceous gland. Its job is to produce sebum, an oily substance that keeps your skin soft and protected. Normally, this oil travels smoothly up the pore and out to the surface. But sometimes things don't go as planned. Dead skin cells or excess oil can block that pore, trapping sebum inside. Now you've got a warm, dark, oily chamber, the perfect environment for bacteria to multiply. One bacterium in particular, Cutobacterium acnes, starts to thrive. As these bacteria grow, your immune system senses an invasion and sends white blood cells to the rescue. What happens next is microscopic chaos. White blood cells attack, bacteria fight back, and inflammation begins. The result? Redness, swelling, and pain. That little white bump you see is actually the debris from this tiny biological battle. A mix of dead cells, oil, and immune cells all trapped beneath the surface. During puberty, hormones crank up oil this production, which is why teens get more pimples. Hormones. But adults aren't safe either. Stress, lack of sleep, makeup, and even diet can all make things worse. The key is balance. Keep your skin clean, hydrated, and let it breathe. Your body will handle the rest. Over time, the immune system clears the infection, the inflammation fades, and your skin repairs itself, cell by cell. From deep under the surface to the mirror on your wall, this entire process happens silently every day. A pimple isn't just a flaw, it's your body performing maintenance, sebum, bacteria, and your immune system. Three tiny players in one big skin story. So next time you see a pimple, remember, it's not just a spot, it's a microscopic battle for balance happening right beneath your skin because science happens everywhere, even right on your face.